guys, the whole procedure didn't take up to up to an hour, thirty minutes. Like, in fact, I was even gisting with the, with the surgeon during the process of um during the process. These things are really very stubborn. They have the tendency of coming back. Till I look away, but I've known you too long. It hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to gray as you fade away. Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient Hello guys and welcome back again to my channel If this is the first time you're seeing my face Welcome, my name is Alice I make videos on family vlogs, lifestyle and entertainment If you're a returning viewer Thank you very much. You already know. Thank you very much for coming back to see this beautiful face. So guys, it is actually um like I think four days post surgery. Um today is actually Friday and I had the colored removal surgery on Tuesday. Four days and as you can see I've removed the dressing for my ears. Don't know if you guys can see this one here. Yeah. Um, this one is healing and this one behind my ear I don't know if you guys can see it um, so they are basically healing fast um, I was unable to make videos there because the plastic surgeon said it was against the ethics of the hospital so I just had to like um Stick to their rules and I was not allowed to use my phone to vlog so basically I'm just going to be telling you guys um, everything that transpired everything that happened um, during the surgery how I felt so as you guys already know um, I had several piercings on my ear and they all went bad unfortunately for me they all went bad and um, for like two or three years it has actually been growing bigger and bigger um, I've tried several things several solutions that a lot of persons have recommended but none actually worked so I decided to visit the dermatologist um, who in turn referred me who then referred me to the plastic surgeon and then I was booked for Tuesday to go for the surgery so guys, the whole procedure didn't take up to up to an hour thirty minutes. Let's let's say max maximum of an hour thirty minutes. That was what the whole procedure took, and it wasn't painful. I was given this um, injection on my ear to knock my ear, um, so I won't feel any pain. I actually did not feel any pain during the procedure. In fact, I was even gisting with the, with the surgeon during the process of. Um, during the process, I was actually just in with the surgeon, so so you guys can tell that it wasn't painful at all. I didn't feel any pain, and it was just like a piece of cake. <laughs> Not until the injection went off and I started feeling pain to my ears, my head was banging and the legs, you know. Um, but I was given some pain relief to relieve the pain and um, antibiotics for infections. And also, I was told to use this um, spirit to clean the ears. This spirit and control. I've been doing that since um, yesterday. I was actually told to remove the dressing today, but yesterday the plaster came off, so I just had to start using this um, spirit yesterday. So I'm going to leave the picture of the before and you guys already saw the after so i'm going to leave the picture of the before and maybe a clear picture of the after so you guys see um, what i'm talking about see how it was and you know the after the surgery i still have like little bumps um, in my ear but um the surgeon told me that those like injection will settle those like it will sort out basically injection is going to sort out those little bumps and that i don't have to worry about them 
Um, and again, it said that um, I was told that I'm, I'm going to go for injection for like um, four months, um, twice every month for um, that's two, four, six, eight, eight times, um, and it's going to be like twice every month injection, just like an aftercare for the kind of so that so that they don't come back, they don't go back. These things are really very stubborn. They have the tendency of coming back. They have the tendency of going back. So I have to follow up, which is why I'm going to use, which is why I'm going to go for the injections. Um, mm. Apart from the pain and every other thing, I feel really excited that finally I've been able to remove this keloid that, you know, it has really been embarrassing for me, you know. Um, and I'm happy that I've been able to like boost my confidence more i'm going to be making hairstyles that you know i feel confident not just because i have to cover my keloid i don't know if you guys understand so guys um that's basically everything um about my keloid and keloid surgery i just want the um this video to be a short video my baby has actually woken up and i'm um i'm going to end this vlog i'm going to end this video to go and you know take care of her. i actually took a little time um now that she and I basically said everything that I want to say. I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and um, comment down below, guys. Subscribe to my channel, please. It actually means a lot to me below, guys. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.